Ooh. Good morning, or afternoon, or night, or evening, or whatever time it is that you're watching this. First of all, thanks for watching. Welcome to another video, a new kind of video. Not a new style for YouTube, because I'm, I'm sure this is done before. Everything's been done. Uh, but a new style for me and my channel. Uh, this is this is the kind of video that I've I've been thinking about making for a long time, um, and it's finally coming coming to fruition. Because you know I, I I have the pleasure of meeting and being friends with a lot of street photographers out there, in, especially in New York City, and I want to be able to bring that knowledge and information that people have stored in in their brains and there that they have accumulated over the years and br be able to bring that to you guys and you know everybody that i have especially in this video their work i i have deep respect for i hope that you guys take this advice to heart i hope it inspires you to get out there and take photos inspires you to you know grow and get better so you know no gatekeeping baby this is 2022. There's no gatekeeping in 2022. I've been collecting the interviews for this specific video for like a year and a half now. So some of these videos will range from like winter time to like basically a week ago in like spring 2022. I hope you guys like it. If you guys do, let me know. Then I'll make more of them. Let me know the questions you guys want answered and I'll, I'll ask them. That's basically it. Anyways, enjoy the video. Have a good day. I'll catch you guys at the end of it. So the question that Paulie prompted me with is, what advice do I have for beginner street photographers? My advice for you is to just start practicing. All you need is a good pair of shoes and whatever camera you have in your pocket, if it's a phone, a disposable camera, or a nice Fuji camera or Leica, you can go out there and practice. So I think it's important when you start off, don't get too hung up on about which focal length to use or which brand camera to use. Just go out there and practice street photography. You have to go out every day. And you have to take way too many bad pictures before you get a good one. Do it for yourself, really. The only person you should really try to be impressing is, is yourself. That's how you're really going to grow. Don't do it for the internet or Instagram or whatever. At the end of the day, like when you, if you look at your own photo, like picture you made, then and you are genuinely impressed by it, then that says a lot more than anyone else could ever tell you, really. <laughs> so, Just shoot a lot, as much as you possibly can. I think if you shoot a lot, that'll take you pretty far. And then, maybe look at a lot of photo books. Those are the two things. I think you're, uh, you're definitely going to underestimate how much time you need to best in doing it in yourself and just trying to understand photography. Yeah, your friend um, calls you to go to their birthday party and it's a sunny day. You're sick that day. You just gotta commit to yourself, commit it to it as much as you possibly can. Uh, I think it would be to walk alone at first to get a real good feel for who you are as a photographer out here and then to study your mistakes. Study them a lot. I'd say first of all, it's probably healthy to get off of Instagram and look at work from people who have done it before Instagram existed. Figure out what kind of photos you like taking, copy that for a little while, or try to copy that. It'll probably be harder than you think. And then just keep taking pictures. A lot of people give up. And if you just push through, you'll get to that next level and you have to get through that frustration. That's all. I mean, there's more. But... Wow. Inspiring stuff, right? I hope that was helpful for anybody that's getting started with street photography. And if you're not getting started with street photography and you still watched all the way through, thank you for watching all of that. I mean, I know it was a quick video, but um, if you guys want me to keep making videos like this where I interview people on the street, let me know. Subscribe to the channel, like this video, leave a comment. What questions should I ask? And yeah, catch you guys in the next video. Au revoir. Goodbye. <laughs> Suck it in. Subscribe to the channel. Now when they see us in the streets, all they want to do is take pics, and I'm like, okay.